Ever wonder what happens when an NFL player with millions of dollars gets bored? Let's just say things get weird. Well, let me tell you, it ain't always on mansions and sports cars. We're talking monster trucks, rocket ships, even a life-sized Thanos Infinity Gauntlet. In today's video, we dive headfirst into the most bizarre purchases professional NFL players have ever made. Prepare to be amazed and maybe a little horrified by the weirdest things NFL players actually bought. Although Darnell Dockett's animal obsession began with a purchase of pet lizards, alligators, and a monkey that cost $30,000, he eventually spent another $100,000 on something that was illegal, a tiger that appeared out of nowhere. Not only could it literally destroy his crib or, you know, kill somebody, but the tiger almost got him arrested when people saw Darnell's tiger lurking around the neighborhood and it turned into an all-out investigation. Everyone thought the man had gone crazy when he posted a picture of it in his house and everyone thought that he had gone insane. Due to the fact that it is not only against the law in Arizona to own a tiger, but it is also illegal. There was a strong suspicion that Darnell had purchased the tigers in the southern region and then used them to covertly transfer them across the country. As soon as Darnell became aware that the federal government was following him, he vanished, and he has not tweeted in years. Considering that this person has constructed a habitat in his garden, it is possible that he has been hiding out with Antonio Brown. Baby, that is relatively little place right there. In reality, AB is a grown man who lives in a treehouse just next to his mansion. The treehouse is about the size of a regular house. Even more impressive is the fact that it includes a living room, a bar, and a top-secret bathroom into the wall. That is most likely the reason why the treehouse cost him more than $200,000 to purchase. To a great extent, Stefan Diggs is dependent on coffee. In reality, he shelled out $15,000 for a diamond Starbucks chain. And when other NFL players learned about this, they purchased even more peculiar chains. When DK Metcalf received a $50,000 chain with his favorite video game, Donkey Kong BVS Diamond, his jersey number, and um, god damn it, this necklace has some cheeks. His neck game became really powerful. This chain also featured his jersey number. On the other hand, was it as insane as what Kyler Murray purchased? No way, because he has two chains. Absolutely not. There are not just one chain, but two chains. Kyler's first purchase was a chain of Bruce Lee, his hero, which cost him $95,000. Despite the fact that this object is brimming with diamonds, Kyler was nevertheless eager to get more of them. A chain of Snickers, which is his favorite candy, was purchased by him bringing the total amount of his collection to $119,000. However, just when you thought things couldn't possibly get any more bizarre, another player's jewelry came dangerously close to getting him killed. Julio Jones went on a trip to the beach, where he wore some of his favorite outfits and also went on a jet ski. At first, everything appeared to be in order. But then, out of nowhere, Julio started going in the wrong direction. Fortunately, Julio did not sustain any injuries and was able to go back on his jet ski. However, he soon realized that his jewelry was missing. Isn't that earring a wonderful piece of jewelry? In all honesty, it was only a small amount, due to the fact that the earring cost $150,000. Julio was not about to just go ahead and buy it. For the purpose of locating his wealth, he contacted a diving crew. After the diver arrived, all of them dove into the sea, with the intention of discovering the jewels that belonged to Julio. The earrings were reportedly impossible to locate, despite the fact that they searched every feasible location, including digging into trees and looking for ice. Rob Gronkowski is the next person on the list on account of the fact that he spent a quarter million dollars on something that is destructive to humans. Whoever possessed his very own monster truck was the very first NFL athlete to ever do so. At a speed of 70 miles per hour, this device can leap 70 feet into the air. Finally, what did Gronk have to say about everything that was going on? I enjoy being a monstrous person. I enjoy how my monster weapons look. It is clear to me why Gronk's trucks is valued at more than $250,000. 
However, the purchase that another NFL player made caused him to become homeless. The fact that Vince Young literally became hooked to Cheesecake Factory, despite the fact that he was a superstar in the NFL and had racked up more than $35 million in earnings, is evidence that money got to Vince Young. Look at the menu for a moment. But as you can see, Vince went to great lengths to acquire his cake, as evidenced by the fact that he would spend more than $5,000 on their food each and every week. And the severity of his addiction increased. In a single night, he spent more than $15,000. He continued to spend and spend until it finally rang. Vince was informed that every single penny of his career profits was gone. And to make matters even worse, he was over $1 million in debt and had to sell his property. All of this was due to his addiction to cheesecake. At least, Vince had the opportunity to enjoy a slice of cake because the gift that another player purchased ensured that he would never be able to get laid. Will Hernandez spent his first million dollars on some peculiar ass things. While some players used their first checks to purchase luxury items such as automobiles, houses, or jewelry, Hernandez used his money to purchase something that would clean his ass. It is a bidet. The bidets are similar to those toilets that do not require the use of toilet paper, if you remember correctly. Nearly $4,500 was spent on the toilet, but it was an investment that was well worth it. All day long, you would spend close to $5,000. On the other hand, he has a passion for superheroes. On the other hand, Hernandez's favorite piece is his Thanos Infinity Gauntlet, which he makes sure to keep with him wherever he travels. And there was a legendary player in the NFL who spent millions of dollars to leave this planet. When Michael Strahan realized that Jeff Bezos' space flights were making headlines, he wanted to get in on the action and do something that no NFL legend had ever done before. Strahan wanted to be a part of the excitement. As a result, he contacted Bezos in order to organize an extravagant journey. Finally, not much longer after that, Strahan made his plan public. Additionally, consider the fact that the cost of a single flight on one of Bezos' aircrafts was $28 million. Therefore, Strahan was not going to take the opportunity for granted. Over the course of the subsequent several weeks, he spent his time getting ready for the launch, and he even intended to carry some nostalgic items along with him on his flight. But as the minutes ticked away on the clock, Strahan was aware that once he put on the costume, it was time for the show. Finally, the day arrived at some point. When Strahan and his co-pilots arrived, they were prepared to make history. However, as they climbed the launch tower, the anxieties began to set in. The crew of Strahan was going at a speed of 2,300 miles per hour, which meant that they were already above the clouds in a matter of seconds. They finally reached a height of more than 62 miles above the atmosphere of the Earth. Having the best of their life, the group was officially in space and floating around. They were having a marvelous time. However, the only issue was that it could not continue indefinitely. The aircrafts eventually made their descent and parachuted back down to Earth. And what appeared to be a moderate step for men turned out to be a significant leap for a legendary player in the NFL. So, there you have it folks, a glimpse into the wacky world of NFL player spending. Let's be honest, some of these purchases are just plain hilarious, right? What do you think? Did any of these top your list for weirdest? Hit that like button and subscribe. We'll see you on the next one.